How do we worship the Creator? We worship the Creator through Scripture. Through Scripture. Because I can't worship the Creator my way. You can't worship the Creator your way, her way, they way, his way, her, they way. No, we got to worship the Creator through Scripture. So who was Scripture brought to? Me and you or prophets? I ask. Was, was Scripture brought to you? Him, me, or scripture was brought to prophets and passed on to us? Yes, God sent scripture to prophets and prophets lived it and we witnessed it. And from us witnessing it, we became the followers of prophets. It's a very clear formula, no mystery about it. The people who followed Abraham Follow the scripture that God sent down to Abraham. The people that followed Moses follow the scripture that God sent down to Moses. The people that followed Jesus, the companions of Jesus, the disciples of Jesus, they follow the scripture that God sent down to Jesus. And the scripture, the people that followed the prophet Muhammad, peace and blessed be upon him, they follow the scripture that God sent down to the prophet Muhammad, peace and blessed be upon him. Because God is not a mystery God. He communicates with the human beings in the same way he has always communicated with them. He sends his angel down to his prophet, and that pro gives that prophet a scripture, and that scripture to be followed. This is the way that God has communicated with his creatures. Now, sure, you and I, we got some inspiration inside of us. God inspire us in dreams. God inspire us with some words. God inspire us with some feelings. But that ain't scripture. Scripture is something that God spoke to an angel. Angel spoke to a prophet. And that prophet memorized it. And that prophet passed it on to others who memorized it. And that scripture became enshrined. And that's what we follow. So I'm calling upon you as a Christian, or I'm calling upon yourself as a, as a, a Hindu, or whatever we might culturally or ethnically want to call ourselves, to be a person that is believing in God, one God, and then a person who is acknowledging that God speaks to us through Scripture, because Scripture is law, and law is to be obeyed. Scripture ain't passion. Scripture ain't feeling. Scripture is not pleasure. Scripture ain't how you think and how I think. Scripture is what is written by the hand of God, what is spoken by God and given to prophets. It's revealed, it becomes law. So scripture is also legislation. It is also education. It is also inspiration. But who it comes from? Almighty God. And who is given to? Prophets. Passed on down to us.